Five targets. Uncle Barry, Barry here. Yeah. Oh, right. Howdy, outlaws! Welcome back to my show. Sorry for my car that's running. It's freaking 86 degrees out. I don't want to be sweating in this car, okay? So here's a thumbnail of this. So, if you're a fan of my content and I'm making you hungry, consider smashing that subscribe button, clicking that notification bell. Also, I'll let you know which is good and what's not. <laughs> and like I said, every Saturday I have Outlaws Hideout that people like to watch. And sometimes I post workout videos on here, Outlaws Workout and Cookouts. All right, I'm here to try Popeye's new chicken nuggets. Let's show you at Outlaws. Check this out, Outlaws. Popeye's new 12-piece chicken nuggets. Look at all those chicken nuggets right there, guys. Is that making you hungry? Let's see if this can outdo Chick-fil-A or McDonald's or Wendy's or maybe an Arby's. We'll have to find out for Burger King. And brought myself a drink right here. I'm drinking unsweet tea. Not bad. Better than soda. All right. And so what do you guys think of it? Anyways, they gave me some sauce. I tried to order this on DoorDash, but apparently they're not delivering in my place anymore. So I had to just get it here. And <laughs> it took 30 minutes to get it through the freaking drive-thru. It was a nightmare. But here, let's just try one regular. Here you go. You guys can try it first. Here. The breading on here is crunchy. What, um, white chicken meat, moist. This looks like you just put lots of bread and make it look like chicken nugget. Here's the sweet heat. Ooh, curb plump. The sweet heat, man, gives it a spicy taste. Let's try with the barbecue sauce. Well, these are pretty good. There we go. The barbecue does not go well with this. I think this way he goes better. The barbecue sauce is a little spicy too. But the sweet heat is just right. They did well with the breading on here. I see what they probably did is to put breading and then put the chicken nuggets in the fryer and fry it. Unlike Chick-fil-A, I like the grilled nuggets the most because it has grilled marks on it and then regular chicken nuggets. They're not like this breaded. They're just chicken nuggets, just put it, put it in the fryer, boom, they're done for Chick-fil-A, McDonald's, Wendy's, and Burger King. But they did it differently at, um, at um, Popeye's. Oh, look right here. The presentation looks nice. I think you'd use some more seasoning on it. And then got some sauces and some unsweet iced tea. So what would I give us on my rating? Yeah, you get a crunch with this, but I think they would have to just put more seasoning on here. I mean, like, um, they're more crunchy when you have the nuggets like at um, Wendy's because they put all the seasoning in there and make it spiciness. They don't have spicy nuggets. Maybe a Popeye's has spicy nuggets in the future might do better, but this doesn't have that much seasoning on here. It's all right. Without that sauce, it would get a two out of five. So an Outlaw's rating. I'm going to give Popeye's Chicken Nuggets, I'm going to give it a 3.3 .3 out of 5. 
it's okay, but I think what I recommend on here, like put some seasoning on this, on this, try to make it look like Wendy's, because Wendy's by far, in my opinion, I think they have the best chicken. Well, actually, I take it back. I think Chick-fil-A has the best nuggets when it comes to grilled chicken nuggets, but the best I like fried or fried chicken is Wendy's. And this was like six ninety four. If you get eight of these, or you get eight at um, Burger King, it's like I think a dollar forty nine or so. While these are four dollars at Popeyes. But at least they give you sauces with this. So yeah, three point three out of five. So if you're in Popeyes, try to go there. But if there's a packed drive through. I advise probably skip it. I was gonna say something funny. I was in a packed drive-thru. Around, what is it, 11.30 right now? And there's this, this family trying to come in. The guy's like, sorry, the, the dining room's closed. And they're like, the guy's like, yeah, dang it, dang it. He gets all mad, gets his family in the car and just goes, yeah, speeds away. <laughs> that was funny. I could see he didn't want to stand and he didn't want to be in the drive through for the line, but hey, well, during this pandemic and our mask mandate, you got to go through the drive through again. And when I was at lunch at work, I tried to go to Popeye's, but it was closed in a drive through. No, no, it was closed in the dining room due to shortage on staff members short staff so this pandemic sucks but eh, maybe it'll change it yourself a 3.3 .3 out of 5 all right guys so at the end of this video i'm going to recommend some good content for you to check out roll the credits you can click on my playlist right here for daily outlaws five star reviews click the round subscribe button to jobbers or us Click the round subscribe to Outlaws Generation. You can check out my patreon.com slash Outlaws Generation. That's it for the review. You can't review it until you taste it. Until next time, join us Outlaws Next Food Adventure. Outlaws Outlaws Generation out.